Hi guys! Welcome back in my channel. Again, my name is Brindis. Today, I'm going to show you how to bake Insai Mada. It's been a while since the last time I ate Insai Mada. So today, I'm going to bake so I can eat some Insai Mada. So guys, if you want to give a try, please watch my video until the end. I will try the best I can step by step so you can follow my recipe if you want to try this inside mada by brindis in this bowl i dissolved the yeast and sugar in a one cup of black warm milk and i also have here a cup of sugar four cups of all-purpose flour one teaspoon of salt three eggs now in the mixing bowl I am going to put the dissolved milk and yeast mix then after mixing the eggs I'm going to put it in the mixing bowl then I'm also adding the salt now I'm going to add the sugar mix it all together so all the ingredients will be well incorporated once you finish, then add your flour. Then mix it very well for at least 3 to 5 minutes or until this all ingredients is well incorporated. Then add 150 grams of butter. Then add it in the mixing bowl and mix it all together. By the way guys, I'm also adding a half cup of warm water because I find it a little bit dry. Then let it rise for one hour or two or until the dough become double. After I let it rise for two hours, I put it in a surface and flatten it only by hand but you can also use a rolling pin if you like
Now I finish to put it in a baking form. Let it rise for another one hour. Then bake it to 180 Celsius or 350 Fahrenheit for 12 minutes. Now here is my finished ensaimada. I finished to grated some cheese and another parmesan cheese as well to mix it all together to put on the top of my ensaimada. Then I'm going to show you later. Here is my newly baked inside mada. Thank you guys for watching. And if you haven't subscribed yet, please do subscribe. And don't forget to click the notification bell below for more videos to come. Bye!